Welcome to Dadashi Science, where our goal is to make science simple. Please like this video and subscribe to our channel so we can produce more helpful science content. Ions are just atoms with a charge, but the charge can be positive or negative. In this video, we are going to cover the difference between cations and anions and how they form. In order to understand the difference between a cation and an anion, there are a couple concepts you need to remember from other videos. Element notation, subatomic particles, and determining the number of protons, neutrons, and electrons in an atom. If you don't remember this information or need a refresher, please check out our videos on all of these topics. Cations and anions are simply atoms with a charge. This is easy to remember as they both have the ending ion. The difference between a cation and an anion is what charge they have. Cations are always positive and anions are always negative. One easy way to remember this is that there's a letter T in the word cation and this looks like a plus sign. Cations are positive because they have lost electrons while anions are negative because they have gained electrons. If you need a refresher on how to determine the number of electrons in an ion, please check out our video. Let's look at some examples. Our first example here, we'll look at Al3+. Al3 plus is a cation because it has a positive charge. Our next example we'll look at is Cl minus. Cl minus would be considered an anion because it has a negative charge. Our next example we'll look at is Na plus, and this would be a cation because it has a positive charge. And our final example is O2 minus, which would be considered an anion because it has a negative charge. Simply put, whether it has a positive or negative charge will help you determine whether or not it is a cation or an anion. Now you know how to identify a cation and an anion. If you found this video helpful, please like the video and subscribe to the channel to help us be able to produce more helpful science content. If there is a specific topic you need help with, please let us know in the comments.